My name is uh, Dr. Carlos Rodriguez. I am uh, uh, from Caracas, Venezuela, equine veterinary practitioner. And I'm going to show you on this video how to make a fluff use of the uh, hoof testers and uh, tell you, show you how, which uh, anatomical structures I am making pressure on to uh, diagnose pain in the uh, a uh, precise area. So, when a helper or putting the hoof between my legs, I'm going to start by by uh, opening my hoof sensors and I'm going to make a pressure in the hoof wall and also in the Mars. And I'm going to make pressure, as everyone, look at my hands, everyone. I'm going to make a, a just a little pressure like this. And if there is no sign of pain, uh, no problem. But if there is a sign of pain, I don't know. When I am doing the, uh, the pressure with the testers, what I am uh, making pressure on is it in the frog, uh, it's in the Mars, and outside the doors of football. Okay? So when I pressure, as you can see, is the vortex of the third phalanx. And I am also making pressure on the sensitive structures in this area. So I can imagine there is a hematoma or an abscess developing in that area. Then I, I can continue making pressure in this area, in the sole, near the white line, making pressure, and then continue surrounding the, the sole. And what I'm doing, when I'm making pressure, I am, uh, I am following the marginal order of the third phalanx. And we have to remember there is a flexus here of the second flex artery, the circumflex vein, and there is also the circumflex nerve. And uh, so if I found pain in this area, I can imagine that a uh, subsolar abscess or hematoma or trauma area is uh, developing a swelling. And so if a horse uh, shows them a positive reaction with the hoof testers, I can uh, imagine the affected area is here or here or here, uh, so I can give a protection on the treatment uh, with a, a therapeutic shoe. So imagine this is the horse. I got a pressure here in the mar in the marginal border, and step by step. I'm going to tough graphic revision with my hoof testers where the pain exactly is located. Okay. Then I am going to follow after finishing the bars, one side, the medial and the lateral side. Then I'm going to make a pressure on the frog in the middle third of the frog, more exactly. The navicular bone is located. You can see in the third, uh, middle third, the navicular bone exactly located. You can see the vertex of the navicular bone, lateral and medial in the other side. This is the exact location. One centimeter and a half from the coronary band down. So, it's here now. Okay. So, in the widest part of the hoof, one centimeter below the coronary band, and you're just gonna make pressure in one side and then the other side. So, what I'm looking for when making pressure in these areas okay, is to Push 
here in the middle third and in the widest part of the hoof, one centimeter and a half below the coronary band. Okay? So I would be pushing, I would make it pressure exactly where the, lip, the, where the navicular bone is located. So the final uh, uh, test I'm going to use with the hoof tester is to pressure the widest part of the hoof, the medial and the lateral, I'm going to make pressure. So I will make it pressure, as you can imagine, in the navicular bone. Then finally, in the middle third and the dorsal hoof wall, I will uh, make pressure in the frog, you know, and I will make the pressure, and I will be making pressure on the deep digital plastic tendon. I will be pressuring as well the digital, uh, 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 the digital cushion. I'm also going to be making pressure on the deep digital fracture tendon, and then finally. I want to be making pressure on the synovial bursa of the navicular bone, and then the navicular bone. So this is a, the video that I'm trying to explain. The, uh, I also show you this wonderful uh, diagnostic tool, which is very cheap. And for those that can uh, know how to weld, and they know how to forge, you can do it by yourself or you can buy. Uh, but the, the best one for all kinds of horses is this size. This size, uh, you can use uh, any brand. They are almost all the same. There is no difference between brands. So you can look at the cheapest price and they will do the same work. Uh, I just wanna, Say bye bye, I will continue my, my chemo treatment and then uh, reconstructive uh, surgeries on my face and please uh, wish me good health and good luck with the surgeries. Bye bye, thank you very much.